Hi everyone, it's Roxanne here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make your own toothpaste, as well as discuss different natural options for cleaning your teeth. One of the natural ingredients that you can use to clean your teeth is coconut oil. Oil pulling is an ancient technique that removes plaque and bacteria, exposing whiter, brighter teeth. Coconut oil is naturally antibacterial and can also help to reduce gum disease. Place a tablespoon of organic coconut oil into your mouth and swish and swirl it around your mouth for about 5 to 20 minutes, then rinse. Another thing you can try is hydrogen peroxide. Hydrogen peroxide is a bleach that is most often used in commercial teeth whitening products. It bleaches stains from teeth to restore their natural white color. Mix half a cup of water with two tablespoons of hydrogen peroxide and swish it in your mouth for one minute. Brush and rinse with water to remove the hydrogen peroxide. Repeat daily until you see lighter teeth. Another thing you can try is activated charcoal. Activated charcoal whitens by absorbing plaque and other tooth staining substances, leaving your teeth cleaner and brighter. Activated charcoal can actually be helpful in changing the pH and health of the mouth and is effective in preventing cavities and killing the bad bacteria present in tooth decay. Wet your toothbrush and sprinkle with food grade activated charcoal powder and then brush for two minutes. Bicarbonate of soda. Baking soda encourages the formation of plaque and helps to prevent gum disease. Baking soda is mildly abrasive which helps gently buff away surface stains. It also fights bad breath and helps in treating painful mouth ulcers. I would like to mention that repeated usage of baking soda can soften the adhesive used to hold braces. Therefore, people using braces are advised to keep away from it. Also, if you have sensitive teeth, you should stay away from it. We used to brush our teeth with it, but found that as a family, it was too gritty to be used on its own constantly. If you would like to use it, wet your toothbrush and sprinkle it with bicarb, then brush for two minutes. Another thing you can try is bentonite clay. Bentonite clay gently polishes your teeth while adding beneficial minerals such as calcium, potassium and magnesium to your body. We use it in our toothpaste recipe, which we will show you in a moment. You can brush with pure bentonite clay mixed with water to make a paste, but it certainly does not taste good on its own. Xylitol. Xylitol is a natural sweetener derived from the fibrous parts of plants. It does not break down like sugar and can help keep a neutral pH level in the mouth. Xylitol also prevents bacteria from sticking to the teeth. Because the bacteria in the mouth that are causing cavities are unable to digest xylitol, their growth is greatly reduced. I don't recommend using xylitol to clean your teeth, but you can add it to your natural toothpaste recipe without any harmful effects. Salt. Salt is a gentle abrasive that removes surface stains from teeth. Salt water helps inflame gums and rinses away bad bacteria in the mouth. To make our natural toothpaste recipe, you will need two tablespoons of bentonite clay, one teaspoon of xylitol, one teaspoon of salt, five drops of peppermint essential oil, and enough water to make a paste. Combine the bentonite clay with the xylitol, salt, and peppermint essential oil. Add enough water to make a paste. Mix well using a plastic or wooden spoon. The clay should never come into contact with any metals. You will have to see how much water you will need to get to the consistency you prefer. We like our paste slightly more on the thick side rather than too runny. You can also adjust the xylitol and essential oil if you prefer it more sweet or with a more peppermint flavour. To use, simply place a small amount onto your toothbrush and brush as you would with regular toothpaste.